It's a big day for the big one. Today marks the 100th year broadcasting for 700 WLW. 100 years is a mighty <laughs> long time. The nation station revolutionized radio and the way information was broadcast to the public. Brad Underwood spent the night at the studio with the hosts who are still on those same airwaves today. Settle in, we've got you for two hours tonight, a celebration of 100 years of this fine station. Talking a little history tonight on 700 WLW. Now a host, Lance McAllister, remembers being a listener when he was a kid. It's amazing to me how the industry has changed. I grew up knowing if I wanted to listen to Bob Trumpy, I had to listen at 6 o'clock. It was appointment listening because if you missed it, there was, no, there was no other way. There are other ways now with the internet, podcasts, and social media, but some things are the same like making sure WLW continues to put hometown talent on air. It's very humbling. I mean, I, I'm the kid who grew up in Anderson Township listening to Bob Trumpy do sports talk, and I've always said he was the, the godfather of this this industry, this format of talk radio. 100 years on the air is, is one thing. 100 years is driven by uh, the personalities. Without the personalities, it's just a signal for 100 years. It was the station that was always on. So I remember listening to Sports or Consequences and Gary Burbank and Mike McConnell and Willie Cunningham, the great American, right? And so for me to now work here is, is just unbelievable. Rocky Boyman is another local now on air. The retired football player co-hosts Eddie and Rocky. It's, it's in my hometown. You know, I get to do radio and, and talk about stuff that's going on in the community that I live in, which is, is pretty neat. There it is, the big one, the WLW Tower here in Mason. And did you know back in World War II, it was actually guarded by armed security to protect the signal strength? Well, the security, not quite the same today, but the signal just as strong reaching most of North America. From Burbank to Marty and Joe, Willie, Ruth Lyons, and Bob Braun, the list goes on and on. For 100 years, the big one has been a place to turn to to get all the talk, all the sports, and all the news. There's a sense of responsibility of wanting to, you know, maintain the excellence when you see the list of names of people who have been here over the hundred years that the station's been going on. For 16 of them, Jack Crumley's voice has been a constant, making sure you know what's happening in the community. It's a really great group of people and I'm, I'm really honored to be a part of it. Brad Underwood, Local 12 News. A big happy birthday to everyone yeah, there at WLW.